Hello everybody and welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West where we are going to hop right back in to this. I should select it. Um, Shadow in the West. Don't care about that. Okay. I managed to remember to change my outfit. It's our prisoners. I got all the loot. Quick. Who is she? Hello. Help us! Yeah. Well, hey. Calm down, everyone. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm gonna set you free. Blessed thanks. Once I loot everything. Blast paste, good. Baltow sludge. Hang tight. I'll get you out of there. I am gonna get. Oh, like I'm gonna get hit by from behind. You're safe now. <laughs> get as far from here as you can. What will you do? Clean up this mess. Alone? That's certain death. Sure. For the bad guys. All of you, find a place to hide while I finish this. They. I, this is foreshadowing. I'm take care of Ezra. I'm not gonna be able to defeat him by myself, guaranteed. Well, I say that, but I probably will. But. The game is pushing me towards having friends. Time's up. Warbots are right outside. Inputting detonation sequence. Alpha, Charlie, Echo. Shit. Safety switches won't disengage. No time to do it manually. It's over. I failed. God. If you're listening, look out for my little girl. So they didn't manage to blow it up. Dang. Dang. Oh, I'm gonna cry. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Actually, legitimately. That little girl comment's gonna make me just lose my mind. <laughs> okay, it's fine. <sighs> Man, I guess there wouldn't be any of the bunker left, but I thought, I don't know, maybe some was left? I don't know. I'm gonna get my buns handed to me. There's an acid canister over there. The old ones are mine alone. I mean, that's just patently false. By mastering them, I will secure our future. Maybe you should secure your hideout first. <laughs> oh, hi. The savior of Marie. How kind of you to deliver Shut up, Vesra. It's over. Hardly. You may have driven us from the sun. You look a little rough. But now is the time for revenge. This is a boss arena. If they, if the eclipse has has overriding um, machines, that ravager isn't gonna make things easy. I gotta take it oh, out. Oh no, I don't have acid capabilities. Okay, acid's not really not really a thing you're worried about. That's cool. I can't I can't do this. Okay, Ravager. I'm used to having things like memorized. Oh good. Uh stop blinking at me. What am I looking at? Ravager? Wait. You said Ravager? Oh boy. Okay, there, I got it. I think I got it. Yep. I didn't have Ravager yet. Uh, is this the cat one from the last game? It looks a little different. I think it is. Like, not, not the leopard one, but like the big one. The, no. Yeah. Yeah. Oh boy, okay, rope caster. Let's do rope caster on it. Ooh, it has a detachable weapon. Too bad I can't I can't detach things. Ha ha ha. Shock storage. What are those ones? I don't have that. How exciting. How nice for me. 
Oh, I don't have a oh, wrong weapon. This is so dumb how I just have to like run around into my inventory. <laughs> we can try, I don't know, I don't know if ice would work against it. Explosives work? It's not really you. Gee, hang on. Okay, that didn't do much either. Oh, jeez. I'm stuck in a corner! these canisters. My blade will find oh, I do need that. <laughs> I was hoping to pick it up fast, but oh my gosh, this thing is brutal. This is brutal, but it's okay. I'll figure it out. I don't think I have cleanse potions yet. Things are just slightly different enough that it's like, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Skip. Come over. That ravager isn't gonna make things easy. I gotta take it out fast. Perfect. Oh no. Switch weapon. And Thunder Sling. Oh jeez. It's like losing strings as fast as I can put them on. Oh my gosh, that... <laughs> I was so close, but that wave does so much damage. I was gonna hit it with my last javelin. Part of the problem is that I've walked into this situation with ill-equipped. I don't have a lot of... Okay, here we go. We can fix this now. Like, trying to change things on the fly is not good. Oh, jeez! I'm not giving up. Oh, jeez! I should no. 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 That's what I get. That's what I get. That's what I get. This feels like I'm playing Elden Ring with the amount of times I'm dying. Not that I'm actually playing Elden Ring. I just, you know. Oh my gosh. Every time I die, which has been like four times now, I have to go back in here and change my stuff. You're going down next! Oh my gosh. Can't do much without ammo. And I can't craft anymore, okay.
I am cheesing this hardcore. Apparently. This guy is tough though. This is ridiculous. And his weapon's got like knockback. Oh boy. Let's see if this works on him. Hoping it would knock him over, but apparently not. Maybe I'll just snipe him. Oh, jeez, oh, that was rough. What I wouldn't give to watch you die. You'd have to try a lot harder for that. Not with this. We'll both be gone in an instant. Dang it, I wanted to I wanted to loot the area. I wanted to get that metal burn. That's why I was trying to or whatever it was. I was trying to loot it earlier. Oh, okay, maybe we can go back. Like during the fight, because I thought they might whisk me out of here really fast. That wasn't nearly strong enough to blow us all up. Oh, it's still gonna whisk me out of here. Oh, hey, thank you. Are you okay? Yeah, yeah, I'll be fine. Let me back in. I hoped you just beat the snot out of these bastards, but this is beautiful. The others, I, I told them to hide. Are, are they? Everyone's okay. They all found a safe place. I figure we'll camp out here until we get our strength back up. Then I'll take everyone back to plain song. Thanks, Yef. Listen, sometimes during his ramblings, Bezra mentioned his former comrades. Said they'd arrive any day now. Are we safe? I don't know. But I intend to find out. <laughs> We're gonna like Bezra spend some time in here. We're gonna stand heroically. Take a look around. Find out if there's any more eclipse we need to worry about. Yeah, they won't be gone, though. Loyal eclipse. Oh. If you're seeing this, it means you've left the Sundom in search of something to follow. Your journey is almost over. Follow the sun beyond the gates of barren light. And bask in the gloom of future yeah. conquest. We heard this a one. New empire awaits. I've seen this before. Mm -hmm. I think that's the last of them. I left word in the dawn. If the others are still alive, they'll find it and try to join me here. Not if I take them out first, which I did. Could draw my focus, see what it picks up. I mean, we already did. What's in there? That's outside. There's that mysterious signal that I keep seeing. What is, what is, where? Where is that? I, ancient valuables chest, but I'm not sure how to get there. I think I saw it from the outside too. Open it. Oh, well, okay then. Five tribes. Five bombs. Oh. That's what I need. With their capitals in ruins, they will have no choice but to submit to my rule. I'll say this for Vesra. He dreamed big. I mean, they already kind of tried that in the last game. Anyway. that's all I need to know. I should talk to Yef. Let him know what I found. Um. That makes sense that he came here then, or he found the bombs here, because apparently the ordinance didn't go off, right? Those bombs didn't go off in the old one's time. So. Did I pick up everything? 
Uh, okay. Yeah, it didn't go off in the old one's time, so there's still big bombs here. Can I open it? No? Okay. What did you find? Bezra's comrades are dead. The Utaru have nothing to fear from the Eclipse anymore. And neither does the rest of the world. Oh, really? Well then. Can't imagine there's anything a scrawny forager like me could ever do for someone like you. But if you ever need a favor, you can find us in Plainsong. I hope you make it there. It'll be nice to have more allies there. I'm glad I did this. I wonder if this is, I mean, it wouldn't surprise me, right? It, I mean, so it wouldn't surprise me if we kept seeing, you know, remnants of the eclipse, but it also wouldn't surprise me if they just gave us like a little tiny, you know, like just the actual remnant of the eclipse. Um, I saved the dot. Okay, cool. <laughs> um, and like we were done with it. Like now we've actually taken out everything. Oh, I meant to use... this range damage health recovered per hit that's right I meant to use that in that fight and I didn't craft more ammo from the same resources if I could move faster that would be nice what is this <laughs> I don't have what well, yeah, I don't have the bolt blaster yet I don't think but the hunter bow I'm gonna be a javelin woman. This is good. I'm I'm doing pretty well. No, I'm not. I'm actually not doing very well. <laughs> Let's be real. I'm dying a lot. But I really just want to find. Maybe if we get to plane something. Well, no, because they don't they don't have like weaponry. I just want to buy some bad a weapons. Like I want to want to I want to buy the blue versions of my current weapons. Better armor. Would love that. I should run down and grab this really quick because I think this is going to be good to get in and out of the area. We can eventually get over to here. Oh my gosh, this game. I'm like, mm, I feel like I'm getting kind of close to the middle of the game. Frick, I've only been playing this game for like, what, 15 hours? Like, you fool. You absolute ignoramus. I only know that word because I used to go to Cracker Barrel all the time with my family and I didn't scan the Ravager! No! Did I get it? No, I didn't get the Ravager because I didn't scan the body. That was the other thing I wanted to do was I wanted to scan the body of the Ravager and it just chucked me out. Anyway, when you go to Cracker Barrel, there's this fun little game. I can't remember the name of it, but it's like a, it's like a little triangle. It's got little sticks in it, essentially. And you're basically kind of like playing checkers with yourself. And it's like if you have so, like four sticks left, you're an ignoramus. But if you only have one left, you're a genius. And I was like, what's ignoramus, mom? She was like, that just shows your ignorance. No, she didn't actually say that. <laughs> it just means you're stupid. As far as I know. <laughs> But it's a really fancy word for stupid. Excellent. This is cool looking though. To avoid losing progress. Well, you guys auto save for me for the most part. Okay. The only thing I have really is. I could do the cauldron. <laughs> am I? I'm only level 14 though. I am a baby. Maybe that's part of the reason. What level is the big quest at? The main quest. Level 15? Okay, I can do that. I don't usually let that determine how I do things, but, you know. Unless I play Assassin's Creed Odyssey, in which case I have to be like two levels above the required one, otherwise I'll just die instantly, all the time. Which sucks. Unless you buy for $15 the booster pack that lets you level up your XP faster, which in the end I had to do because I was just so freaking sick of dying all the time. 
and I was really frustrated it and I will always somewhat resent it for that. <laughs> Yikes, I am not trying to do that. Don't worry about it, don't worry about it, don't worry about it, don't worry about it, I'm running away. I knew it. I was like, there's something in here. Weak versus fire. I could fight it from here, maybe. I actually do, I keep forgetting, but I do have a purge water weapon. I have fire. I can't make any of those. God dang. Or those. I am just. I am. I need to kill more machines, but it's hard. <laughs> it's hard. Oh my gosh. Yeah. It's so pretty. Okay. I need to equip. Shock bow. I'll keep the rope caster. I don't think it can get up here, which is why I'm okay, I think, with not setting any traps. Let's see, what's like the ideal spot? No more ammo, oh my gosh, it's another thing. It takes freaking forever to kill anything. Alright, it takes... Not that. It takes, um... Oh my gosh, these guys are ridiculous. Like, I don't have any ammo capacity. Finally got that one. What? That is not allowed. <laughs> it can't just launch itself out of the water like that. It just can't do that. That is unreal. That's gotta be... Yeah, like, that's gotta be accidental. Let's try doing a purge water explosion. If we hit the purge water canister with purge water weaponry, right? Where is it? Where is that? Okay. I can't do it from here. If I could do it more accurately, maybe, but I can't. Can't craft any of those. This sucks. Okay, that was one of the more boring fights I've ever done. And I honestly don't know. <laughs> uh, I guess I'll keep recording. But, boy, howdy. Boy, howdy. <laughs> A whole lot of nothing happened. I was just sniping from afar for ages. Last purse, yes! I first I want to get everything on the surface, then I will go down under the water and look around. A land- I was like, this doesn't look like a no- oh wait, it's alive! I think it's still alive. I- th I think. I can hear it. That's how I was like, is there something down here still? 
Oh, dang. Is there something I could do? Maybe it's for the best. I was gonna try to loot the body, but dang. Um, well, let's see. Yes, I get it. Why can I not loot? I need that oxygen breather. I know you get one eventually. This is gonna drive me crazy. Well, that's something to keep in mind. This pond here has a land god that's still alive in it. Looks like an Utaru shrine. Oh! What it's for. Oh, is it for the land god that's in the water? <laughs> and stuck? That's what it looks like, because it looks like a triceratop, which is kind of what it looks like the land gods are designed after. Like plow horns or something, I think they're called. Where is it? Yeah, plow horn. Alright, yeah. There's a land god in there. I have been sidetracked. What is this? A spaceship? It, I mean, it kind of... Uh, maybe it's just an airplane? <laughs> oh! Maybe that mysterious source of signal things up here, maybe? It looks like I'm close to the locator beacon that my focus detected. Signal's coming from behind that rubble. If I can get through to it. Oh. How do I do it? Let me. Let me have, please. What? Black box. It was a plane. Oh. -ho. I don't know if I want to hear this. That time to cry. Come to one engine. Mountainous terrain. And you actually landed it. How did you do that? You saved our lives. Yeah. But it's what? Four hours before the swarm gets here. I should have let us all die in an instant. Now the twelve of us are trapped, waiting for the end. It must have been terrifying. Just <sighs> I, I wouldn't do it. I don't think. We're trying to survive. This pharaoh's machine swept the planet of life. All those people lost. <laughs> I will never, ever, ever forgive Ted Farrell. Ever. There must be another crashed plane out there. Oh my gosh, we have to go around finding the remnants of people who were trying to escape and survive, even though it was futile, all because of one man? Mm, I'm gonna just lose my freaking mind right now, legitimately. Oh, it's so infuriating. Like, I don't know, maybe I'm empathizing too much, but like you can imagine yourself in this situation and like imagine going to your family and like huddling down and knowing what's coming, but knowing you can't do anything about it. What would you do? Would you just wait to be like, decept like dissipated, like eaten alive? Or would you like take that leap? You know what I mean? Like, I, I don't know, man. I don't think I could just wait. I don't think I could do it. Oh, anyway, that's really super mega depressing. I don't know what they but holy cow. That's, that's really depressing and I don't want to think about it, but wow, look at Too bad it's cloudy. Is there anything else? Okay, so they did survive. I was like, but the plane's in really bad shape. But somehow they survived the plane crash? <laughs> I don't know. Is there anything back there? You've sent me to a place with a 
Oh my gosh, you scared the crap out of me. Taking out my rage on the animals. Oh, well. This looks like it's it for right here, right now. But I think I will call this episode here. Legitimately don't know how long this will be because it's about an hour of a recording and I don't think I did much at all. Uh, so, besides die. A lot. So hopefully it's fun to watch <laughs> in some way. And we'll try to get to playing song in the next one. So thank you all so much for watching. I appreciate it. Really quick, let me say thank you to my patrons. To all my patrons, but to especially Reese Scalito, my sapling tier patron. Thank you so much for your support. And an extra special thank you to Christopher, my tree tier patron. Thank you so, so much for your support. I really appreciate it a lot. Uh, thank you all again, and I hope to see you in the next one.